the army was very, very discreet. It's about 30 seconds ago, at 7 p.m., they only gave us, the, 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 the reporters and correspondents, some of the information. Uh, they kept it very, very close. Uh, they're saying that there was nothing wrong uh, with the actions of the soldiers who were killed, uh, uh, both uh, uh, the two soldiers who were killed while on guard, and then the other soldier who was killed as uh, other forces came in, closed in on the terrorist. Uh, the head of the Faran uh, Brigade, as far as we understand, uh, will be removed from his post to another post in uh, the IDF. That is quite uh, dramatic. We have to say this uh, uh, specific uh, uh, brigade commander that we're speaking about, eventually he is the one who killed the terrorist at the end. But all of the actions leading uh, uh, to uh, that eventual uh, killing of the terrorist, uh, those actions, uh, there, there, there were flaws uh, perhaps there. The fact that he was somewhat distant uh, from uh, the area of the activity, uh, the fact that he chose perhaps uh, to close in on the terrorists before there was assistance uh, from the air. There was a lot of criticism on the way that the forces, uh, once they, they realized uh, where exactly the terrorist is, there was a lot of criticism uh, regarding the way in which the forces acted. Maybe they should have waited a little bit more for assistance uh, from the air, and that way perhaps uh, uh, preventing uh, the incident in which the third soldier was killed. So we're, we're understanding that uh, one uh, brigade commander will be removed from his post. There are also questions regarding uh, the actions of the uh, Bardalas uh, uh, battalion, uh, the commander of that specific battalion. Uh, uh, there are also uh, perhaps questions regarding the way he acted, and he might also pay a personal price. Uh, so all these findings were presented uh, this uh, morning to the families, and, and they're, of course, the ones who paid the heaviest price. Uh, no eventual flaws in the way that the three soldiers uh, conducted uh, in the field. This is uh, the main conclusion coming from the IDF's uh, investigation. But yes, two commanders and a rather uh, senior commanders, a brigade commander is, is a, a rather senior commander, and he will pay the price, moved to another position within the Army. Okay, Jonathan, uh, get more details, and we'll be back to you in a moment. Uh, Defense Analyst Amir Oran is with me here in, in the studio. Uh, the message of the IDF to the chain of command is that there were big flaws. Indeed. There are flaws regarding the methods and the deployment and the entire defense concept along borders of peace, the Jordan border too. And this uh, is also being looked at by another team headed by uh, a new uh, major general who until recently was in charge of the Gaza division. The Gaza division borders this particular division uh, which is in charge of the Egyptian border. Now, um, as uh, Jonathan reported, the brigade commander, Colonel Ido Saad, um, a 41-year-old uh, career officer, uh, a lot of his service was uh, spent in this very area. So it is not um, uh, for lack of um, any uh, familiarity with the uh, area. And uh, as Jonathan also said, he himself um, has shown personal bravery. Uh, he has uh, stormed uh, the Egyptian uh, soldier, uh, his own radio man who stood um, uh, in proximity was killed by the Egyptian. The uh, colonel might have been hurt uh, himself. Nevertheless, uh, he is going to pay for the flaws found in the after action report. He will not be ousted from the IDF. He will go to another position of, of uh, a colonel and eventually, of course, will go into retirement. The officer in charge of him, the divisional commander, this is somewhat uh, strange because uh, the divisional commander was part of the investigating group, but he too will be reprimanded mm -hmm. either by his own commanding officer, the uh, general in command of the Southern Command, or the chief of staff himself. Uh, his uh, promotion uh, will or will not uh, be impaired by it. This is uh, going to be left. But all in all, 
Obviously, you can't have elite forces everywhere. And this is a low-quality infantry battalion. They get less training. In they, a low-intensity border. Uh, in a low-intensity border, and they are not intended to fight as a battalion. They have done exactly what they were supposed to do, to stand guard where uh, the only, or almost the only activity is smuggling. So this is really a police job rather than right. a military one. This will have to be looked at. Uh, Jonathan, you uh, knew the commander, you know the commander. Quite a long time ago, some five years ago, back then he was the commander of a unit called uh, Caracal. Uh, Caracal, uh, just like Bardelas, which uh, uh, hold uh, this uh, border. Caracal is a mixed unit, men and uh, women. Uh, He's now paying perhaps the, 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 the personal price here. Uh, I have to say, he's a very courageous uh, officer. Uh, 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 you just spoke about it in the studio. Eventually, he is, Ido Saad, is the one that killed the terrorist. That should be said. There are issues regarding if all the way that he acted uh, in in this uh, operation, if it was the right way or, or uh, not. And as soon as this happened, we're a week and a half after the, the incident, it was clear that uh, someone some, someone, and a rather high-ranked officer will eventually have to pay the price because there were mistakes. If, if three IDF soldiers are killed, it was a mistake, especially regarding that uh, third soldier. If All the right. first two were surprised, maybe, that's, maybe that was difficult to avoid. Right. But the third one, uh, I, I think it's clear that, that he should not have been killed uh, while in combat, and, and this happened. This raises question about uh, uh, perhaps the way that uh, this this short fight with the terrorist uh, was was handled. Jonathan, we'll, we'll leave it at that. Thank you very much.